Hi, in this video you'll learn how to rename multiple objects at once. I'll be using the 2.81 version of Blender. In order to demonstrate how to rename multiple objects simultaneously, let's create the objects first. You can just duplicate the default cube several times. So, Shift D, duplicate, 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 and so on. Now, you can see in the outliner that they're called cube, this is the original one, cube 0.001, cube 0 .002, 003, and so on. Suppose you don't like these generic names. Instead, you want to rename the objects box, box 001, box 002, and so on. If this change should apply to only some of the objects with the names containing cube, select them in the outliner. So if you want this change to apply only, for example, to this one and this one, you can just select these two and then rename these two simultaneously. But if you want the change to apply to all of them, to all the objects which contain cube in their name, you don't have to select anything, right? And now you need the batch rename tool. It's available in the edit menu, or you can use the Ctrl plus F2 short key. So let's go to the edit menu and select batch rename. Now what do we have here? Data type. We have objects because we're going to work in objects, but we can also have materials, meshes, curves, armatures, and so on. Then we have two options, selected and all. It depends on whether you want to apply the change to some selected items or to all of them. In our case, we want to rename all the objects with the name cube. So let's select all. Then we have some options, find and replace, set name, strip characters, change case. Let's select find and replace. And what we actually want to do is we want to find each object with cube in its name and replace it with box. Fine. Now we can hit OK. Watch these names over here. OK. They have been replaced. So we no longer have cube, we have box. We no longer have cube 001, we have box 001, and so on. And now let's suppose we want to add the prefix V underscore to all the objects. So, edit, batch rename, and this time let's choose the option set name. And here we should select prefix. Fine. And we should type the prefix here. This should be V underscore. This will add this prefix to all the objects. So watch the names again. Now OK. And as you can see, this prefix has been added to all the elements, including camera and light. And there are many other possibilities, which you can explore by yourself. OK, that's it for this video. If you like it, a thumbs up would be great. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question, you're welcome to do so. Thanks for watching.